Hi, welcome everyone. Uh, today I just wanted to uh, come in and go over our chapters one and two, and but specifically just a brief overview on the expectations for the course. Um, now people are getting settled in, people are moving in and out of the course, people are posting up on their discussion board in your introduction. That'll be your first out of six postings for, for the semester, roughly about one every six weeks. The first one is a very gentle introduction and I'll leave it at 10 points, 250 words. So the subsequent five postings now beginning at the end of the next one coming at the end of week four will be a more critical assessment of the readings on your part. This is where we you really sharpen your critical uh, analytic skills. And I will be posting questions to you during that week based on some specifics from the textbook and things that we are discussing connected to, you know, the our political world, which is everywhere. Um, and that's how discussion posts two through six will be completed. So roughly a one page response, 250 words minimum to each of these these prompts. As far as your exams, your first exam will be coming up on at the end of week three. I will also be providing a study guide at the end of week two, so you will have a study guide for about a week before you take the actual exam, and this will be 50 points, and this will be, you will have a time test via Canvas, multiple choice, and you'll have three of those. So the final is not cumulative, it is simply from that last uh, the second exam, the end of the second exam, which is on week, at the end of week nine, that'll take us through week 18. Okay. Um, one of your other exams, I'm sorry, one of your other assignments will be your critical research paper. Now, this is something you want to get started thinking about. This will be one six page research paper on any political topic of your choice as long as it's related to US politics which is anything will I will be communicating the requirements for that um, to you and also if you're on campus we have the library at your disposal but you also have the I library access to the, our library resources on online and that's 100 points I also want to discuss the community participation report that you have on your syllabus. That's a two-page you know, reflection of a community political uh, event that you attend. This could be anything from our student government meetings on campus to a guest speaker coming to campus to what we will be having here at DVC next week. We have a town hall with, with our local congressperson, um, all these count. It could be an, an art opening with some political arts and you know, a message. It could be a protest, a rally. It could be a city council meeting. So you have uh, roughly about 13 weeks to get this done, but it's good to get this done and there may be some extra credit opportunities down the road. That's only two pages, minimum, maximum, and that's worth 40 points. Nice chunk of points there. The discussion board will be totaled to 60 points, so the three exams will all total 150 points, your research paper 100 points, and, and you will be following this on gradebook, so the course is a total of 350 points. Now, I, I know we've started, I mentioned we sh we're starting very gingerly, to get get acquainted with with the site and start doing the readings get get the books so chapter one is very timely American governments and, pol and politics in a racially divided world um, this is uh, may to a lot of you may seem to be pretty relevant it's in the news it's it's everywhere but this has always been so one thing as we move through this course 